No, no, I'm just a put. I don't know what he was about to say there. I hate to say I'm glad to see you, but I'm so glad to see you. That's okay. The important thing is that you're safe. And I know you can take care of yourself after Nathan. Should have done that a long time ago. But damn, Max. Can't believe you actually drove down here in the middle of a fucking E6 tornado. Just for one photograph? I mean, I know you didn't come for me. Warren, I came for all of you. Just tell me you do have the photograph. I just want... Now shut up and listen. Oh yeah, you're finally going to tell me what you never did in the parking lot. I wish I would have. So I'm just going to tell you without any explanation. Trust me, okay? I always do. You should probably tell me quick. I had a vision in Jefferson's class of a tornado destroying Arcadia Bay. I went to the bathroom and saw my best friend Chloe get shot by Nathan Prescott. You with me so far? Where else could I be? Go on. Then I found out that I could rewind time. And long story short, Mark Jefferson is insane and dangerous. Whoa. Is that all? I started the storm. I have to go back in time. Jefferson already ki killed Chloe. I can't let that happen. I have to do something, Warren. Max, going back in time is what caused the storm. All because, because of me? How? I'm not a real scientist, even though I play one at school, but this seems like pure cause and effect. Maybe chaos theory. What happened with Jefferson? Did... Did he hurt you? Sorry, I was just looking at the types of tornadoes, but... I guess they left out the F in it, but it looks like it's E, F, and then a number. But they just called it the E6. I don't, I don't really know that stuff. I could be wrong. <laughs> could be wrong. Uh... He used Nathan to get drugs and money for him. Jefferson tied me up and dosed me with some drug and took sick photos of me. It was so horrible. Max, I'm so sorry you had to go through all that. You're the bravest person I've ever known. You know, I want to kill that son of a bitch. Where is he? Dead. History which I need to change fast to make it right again. Is that bad? For every action, there's there's a reaction. Whenever you reverse or, or alter time, maybe you cause a chain reaction. That's kind of what I was saying before. Even in the environment. Yeah, that's kind of what I was saying before. When you change it, there's always like something that's going to happen to to make it worse or whatever but it's just like if something's gonna happen you have to let it happen basically um <laughs> more time warren i know this all sounds insane but you're the only other person who i can count on now i wish we had more time together do you believe me max of course I believe you. You're the most amazing person I've ever met. And I'm glad you trust me. Always. I just wish I could trust my powers. I guess we'll never know if it's magic or science. Even if it's from a wizard or a wormhole, you're part of something bigger. And I don't believe in fate or destiny, but after this week, I realize I don't know shit. That makes both of us, Warren. I do know you're here for a reason. And I guess it's up to you to find out why. Max, I'm sorry you got stuck in this. In this, I don't have a fucking clue what's going on. But I have total faith that you'll do the right thing when the time comes. I'm so proud of you, Max. How could there be a more important moment in history? And I'm in the middle of it with you? So thank you for trusting me. Thanks for being here. Always. Okay, so we're gonna go through this shit again. I can't seem to escape the two whales. Yeah. 
Hey, be careful out there. Just in case we don't get out of this, I wanted to say... I know, Lauren. Of course you do. I'm going to make the right choices from now on. I swear. That's why you're super max. Seems like it's clear, and then it jumbles it up, and then you have to figure out where's the sweet spot. I apologize for that, guys. I had to take a uh, quick break. It wasn't that much. It wasn't that quick, but whatever. I'll just cut it out. And... I know, I know. I'm being floating. Just one picture. So we're going back to the party. We got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Ugh. Chloe! Jesus, dude, what is up with you? I'm just glad we're here together. I guess you need to talk. No worries. It's all good. I'm glad you're with me, too. What's going on, Max? We have to find Nathan right now. He's gonna Sorry, be Warren. Sorry, to Rachel. Let's go. Now. Chloe, wait! Listen! I can walk and listen, okay? Stop and listen for once! Fine, Max. I'm listening. Chloe, you can't go in that party. You're going to... You're going to die if you do. You used your powers, right? And you fucked around with time and I died. Not like that. You're supposed to back me up. So there's no way that punk-ass bitch Nathan Prescott is taking me down. You're right, he won't. Mark Jefferson killed you. And others. Jefferson, the art teacher? That's bullshit! Nathan is the fucking serial killer! We saw the proof! Now excuse me, I'm going to that party to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? Yeah, Nathan is dead. Nathan is dead, and you're in danger. That fucker is already dead? How do you know that? Because I was there. Will you please tell me exactly what happened? Please. Oh god, uh... Jefferson hurt me, Jefferson is a psychopath, Jefferson killed him. Well, yeah, Jefferson killed him. Mark Jefferson turned out to be a psychopath. Okay, Max. Let's go in there as a team and take his ass out right now. Chloe. Jefferson drugged and kidnapped me. I was tied up in his bunker. You have no idea what hell I went through to get back here. But I couldn't let you die. You brought me back here, and I can't lose you again. I won't. Um, Max, I'm... I'm so sorry. I was the one who dragged you into all this shit. Nobody, especially you, should have to go through that. I... Now we have to stop Jefferson. With one bullet. No. Not this way. Chloe, I, I can't keep fixing everything if all I'm gonna do is just break it over and over again. I know how this is gonna turn out, and I'm afraid I'm fucking up all these alternate realities. Wait, alternate realities? What do you mean, Max? What did you do? Uh, terrible choice I fucked up. I fucked up, Chloe. I wanted to make things right, but everything turned out wrong. Max, what the hell are you talking about? I was able to go back in time 
to the last day William was alive. I stopped him from leaving, but... But you ended up in a car crash instead. You saw my dad again? You... You were completely paralyzed. And you, you were in pain. You were slowly dying, and you... You asked me to end your life. But Chloe... There was no way I could do that. I had to return to this timeline. To see you again. I had to. God, Max. That must have been... That must have been awful for you. I'm... I'm so sorry I had to ask you that. It was worse for you. But I had no idea what would happen, and as usual, I messed everything up, and... I never want to hurt you. Ever. You have to believe me. Of course I do. Do you think I would even know how to handle that situation? Nobody would. The important thing is that we're together again. You're right. That's... That's why you should come with me, so we can stay together. And stay alive. I hear you, Max, but... Do you think we should let Jefferson get away with torture and murder? Of course not. If we tell David, he'll believe us, and he can actually stop him. Right? I don't get it. Why do you trust him after you totally reamed him the other day? He's not even at our house anymore. David saved me. David was ahead of us. David was David ahead of us? Kind of, kind of, I guess he kind of was. David cares about you. I'm got, I want to go... Where's my mouth? Uh, I want to go for either that one or that one. But I am not sure. David cares about you. I think she'd listen more to that one. Chloe, David saved me from Jefferson. If he didn't track down the dark room, I'd be dead right now. Max, I had no clue. I should have been the one to save you, but I'm so grateful David was there. So what's your plan? We tell him everything, including that Victoria is in danger. Okay. You've been through so much. I, I believe you, Max. After all, I'm still your faithful companion. Yes, you are. So listen, in a few minutes, I won't know any of this happened. Nothing. We absolutely have to stay in your room and do nothing. Then we explain everything to David, and we finally let him do his job. You'll have to tell me exactly what I did and said just now. Just explain that I traveled through time using the photo. Will you believe me? I'll always believe you, Chloe. Tornado still showed up, but we did. <gasps> oh, Chloe! I see that the real Max is back. So, how was your time trip, dude? Shut up! Oh, you're alive! You're alive! Oh, both of us! I did so much to bring you back, Chloe. It worked. It actually worked. You're with me again. <laughs> Looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And I traveled through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over. And I hope it was worth it, but I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life after all my drama. Come on. I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. Just look at what my powers have caused in just a short time. Nobody. You're Max fucking Caulfield, Time Warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. Nobody. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to accept how awesome you are. Maybe I willed it subconsciously or something. I had no idea. I always wanted my life to be special. An adventure. 
could not without you. And it, it didn't happen until I moved back here. So without you, my powers wouldn't even exist. And for whatever scientific, mystical reason that we'll obviously never figure out, we were meant to be together at this exact moment in history. I have to think that Rachel was somewhere behind the scenes, fighting for justice. I'd like to think that too. We all owe Rachel Amber. Now tell me everything that happened. You you remember, right? Well, we we left the party and made sure Jefferson couldn't find us. For once I was glad I lived in an actual fortress. Then the storm got hella crazy, and, and you said we would be safe at the lighthouse. Chloe, look. The storm is getting bigger now. It's coming closer. Oh, I, I can't even believe this is real. This is happening because of me. Stop it. Is this stop beating yourself up, okay? We've both paid our dues already on it. God, look at that. Look at that monster. Who knows? This could be Rachel's revenge. Our revenge. The lighthouse is out of the way of the tornado. Come on! Chloe. I've got your back, Rex. Alfred Hitchcock oh, so famously called sick. film Little Pieces of Time. I I'm back in class. As he what the hell? Us. These pieces yeah, of time can frame us in our glory. I have to listen to this Jefferson lecture again. This might be hell. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer okay, who perfectly this captured is messed the condition in black and white? Am I stuck in a time loop? Anybody? Bueller? Diane Arbus. Be calm and there you go, don't Gloria. freak out. Why Arbus? Yet. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as torture. Nobody seeing What's that? going on? And frankly, it's bullshit. Nobody even cares? Shh, shh, shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame fuck? any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Everybody's gone now. Have I totally fucked up time? I think you did. This doesn't make sense. And I see blood over here. That's where Kate was sitting. Holy shit. Look at all these dead birds. Something? Uh, is... This can't be real. I'm almost wondering if for some reason- I'm like... sorry, Kate. So, I'm actually confused myself, but I'm wondering if something is being... Oh, that's too creepy. Like, played through our minds or something? What the hell is this? Like, maybe we're dealing with some sort of mental issue, and this is what the game is based on? I don't know. <sighs> that's awful. What the hell? Okay. Um... Isn't that what the photo was? We gotta take a photo of also the paper ball was. Not yet, you bastard. I think we are dead. Maybe. Good, like, what if we are dead and this is what we're going through? I'm. I'm trying my hardest figure out what it is but I kind of Rachel didn't deserve any of this these are like memories I see you Max Caulfield don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry excuse me I just wanted to know if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room your purity inspires me so much, and we could be so happy together. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? There's no way I'm saying that. No way. Excuse me? I love you, Mr. Jefferson? I don't think so. Thanks for killing Chloe. My selfies are shit. Our dark room. 
Let's go with that. My selfies are shit. I need to be framed by a real artist. No, I'm just a poser. Yes. You will be posing. For me. There's so many angles I want to expose you with to I'm the world. I'm actually really confused. I hope you don't mind needles or duct tape. And it's gone. This can't be real. I don't believe it. Not even in the school, we're in the fucking dorms. Okay, we, it looks like we started to write a new diary. I need to find a way out, probably out of my brain. Maxine, you keep fucking up. How many times does Chloe have to die in front of you? Maybe it would be better to actually, you know, have a life. Find my cat pics, please. My heart is broken. That is an odd butterfly drawing. Take a selfie, ho. Huh? Yes, you're running out of choices. Let's all go to the lighthouse. Max, why don't you want to kill everybody? What did everybody ever do to you, bully? Go fuck your selfie. Death, only death. Only Chloe. This is fucked up. And there's one text message for everybody. Okay, uh, I'm, I'm going to read it out loud. I, I, don't, I don't know why I started reading it to myself. Max, this is your old pal Chloe. You left in a wheelchair in another reality. Did I thank you before you bailed to a new life? Not only did you blow off my request, you actually you already jumped into another photo. How many fucking times can you abandon me, hippie? Jesus. I guess these were bad decisions. Good evening, young Max. The squirrels talk to me, but how can you? Samuel has no phone. Okay. Hi, Max. Rachel Amber here. Just wanted to introduce myself. I'll be seeing you soon. Real soon. That was probably her down the hallway. <laughs> Bitch, do not mess with Frank or me. You got a snack. A dog texting us. Max, I loved your photo shoot with Jefferson. He absolutely captured you. If you want, we can hang out and get high. Okay. Exit. This is pretty fu <coughs> I kind of lost my voice there. This is pretty fucked up. That's Kate crying over herself. Hey Kate, Max, how could you let me jump off a roof? You were the only person I trusted here, but you never really listened to me. Now I'm never going to heaven. Instead, you've stuck me in hell. Alone forever. No, Kate, I, I was only trying to save you. Um, is it, is it because of all these bad decisions I fucked myself over? I am confused oh, and Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm there? was that? And I can't go back. Is this like a maze now? Am I in a fucking maze? Max, this is not the best time for a prank. Please, please. I just have to keep trying door after door, figure out where the hell I'm going. Or do I have to go into my specific dorm? I've tried the, all these doors. Okay, where did you last put those keys? Think. Think. I'm gonna screw that. 
218 it says is there anything down here I am the key master the key master what are you doing on though 218 isn't what 218 Okay, but we needed the keys to go through. Rachel Amber. She was my angel. After my dad died and you moved, I felt abandoned. Rachel saved my life. So Rachel took my place. I'm glad she was there for you. Six months ago, well. she just left Arcadia without a word, without me. How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. Then poof. That Rachel's bracelet! Why the fuck are you wearing that bracelet? Calm yourself, alright? It was a gift. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that big. She had had a great eye for images I'm and so art. Confused. Plus, she's a smart ass like you. I've taken so long that the soundtrack has ended. 218-223. Did we try this? 223? I guess so. Eighteen, we tried. Two seventeen. Okay, so we definitely did the two doors on this side. And two twenty four. All these doors. I swear I tried that door already. Yeah, water on my cashmere. You know how much this fucking outfit costs? Okay, so that's. Did you think we were best friends forever or something? That was Rachel's room. We have to find Victoria's room. Um. Shh. I think she can hear us. I think my entries for the contest might be too good. I think it was here. It's been so long since I've played, I can't remember what's what. I got it right, ha! Huh. Now we're playing as her. We go to her room? Things are coming along now. Look at me. I am Max Selfie. Oh, they're all the same. I'm honestly confused and scared. Cool. Okay, 
Stella. Tigers on the the Follow the doe. Another damn maze? Don't try to hide, Max! Get over here! Let me capture you! Plus we have to hide from him? Jefferson is coming after me again. Max! No. You used to be so pure, so innocent. Now, you have to die. Let me out the f*** out of here. David, watch out! How? How did you know that? Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. David Madison. Of course. 